Reassembly of the Model 50P Flex Pneumatic Nailer. Before reassembling the nailer, you want to inspect several key areas of the nailer body. Inspect the ledge for damage and plunger surface for scratches. Then turn the nailer over to examine the other side. Once again, check the ledge inside for damage. Mount the nailer in a padded vise with the bottom of the nailer facing up. You are now ready to begin loading the nailer. Place the rubber seat into the bore with the beveled edge facing up. Make sure it is seated completely flat on the inside ledge. Drop the metal support ring in on top of the rubber seat. Coat the cylinder sleeve inside and out with air tool oil. Locate the beveled edge of the sleeve and install with the beveled edge up. Coat the piston seal with air tool oil. Insert the drive blade and piston seal into the bore. This will soften and shape the seal. After one to two minutes, pull the assembly out and replace in the correct position with the drive blade up. Tap the drive blade with the rubber mallet until it seats all the way down into the cylinder bore. Install the rubber bumper. Turn the nailer right side up. Use a piece of wood at the bottom of the vise to support the drive blade assembly. Install a new return cylinder O-ring. Oil the plunger seal. Install the plunger. Use a mallet to tap in while rocking side to side. Install the three plunger screws and firmly tighten. Dip one third of the screw threads into blue Loctite. Firmly tighten all three screws. Turn the nailer upside down in the vise. Pull up on the drive blade until it is fully extended. Slide the channel assembly over the drive blade. Slide the adapter foot over the steel foot. Install the four inch and a quarter screws with lock washers. Firmly tighten all four screws. Turn the nailer right side up in the vise. First, install the body plate. Put the safety yoke in place. Install the screw for the safety trigger cable. Apply white grease to the bottom, top, and sides of the safety yoke. Install the two safety yoke springs. Install the metal cap with four screws. Activate the red safety trigger several times while tightening each screw. This will help center the safety yoke under the cap. 
After tightening all screws, install the rubber cap. Nailer is now ready for connecting air and functional testing.